Come in. Nice to meet you, Mr. Dylan. Hi. How are you today? I'm good, thanks. How about you? I'm fine, thank you. So, today I'm going to need your help with something. We are going to the examination room and I need to transport you with a wheelchair. Are you ready to help me? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. So, at first, I'm going to put the patient's leg up and then with the help of a sheet, I'm going to put him closer to me, to the other of the bed. So, I'm going to push, put, put to pick this and I need you to let my back straight. So, I'm not going to have like partial problems after this. And then in the count of three, I'm going to put, and then I'm going to say to the patient, so Mr. Dillon, I'm going to pull the sheet, I'm going to pull you closer to me. So, okay, in the count of three, one, two, three. <coughs> okay, that was good, very good. Okay, now I need to turn the patient legs to, to this side. And I need to pick his right arm and to put here so he can help me push himself. And I need to pick his legs and turn him a little bit. Now, and then you say to the patient, now I need your help. Like while I'm putting your uh, legs down, I need you to help me push yourself, okay? In a sitting position. Okay. Now, one, two, Three. Okay, yeah, that's very good. Excuse me, and now I'm going to put a seat belt on you so we can help me transfer you. Excuse me. Mm. Now the seat belt is on. It should not be um, very tight. Okay, so you put your fingers here and measure. And then I'm going to say to the patient, put your both of your hands in my elbows. Shoulders. Shoulders. And I need to hold the patient by the, the seat belt. Uh, be sure that you put your knees with the patient needs so you can keep him steady when you when you stand him up. Okay, so on the count of three, we're going to stand. One, two, three. Okay, so let the patient a time to adjust himself and then ask him like to a kind of dance with small steps to the wheelchair that is just behind us. And make sure you do it very slowly. So let's go. Move very lightly. And then please, Mr. Duplessis, put your both of your arms in the armchair and help him and put your knees, knees in his knees and help him sit very low. Make sure that the brackets. The walkers um, of the wheelchair are locked, so the wheelchair will not move. Okay, now he's done. So I have to do one leg. I can, I need to uh, put a shoe in him, in his, in his feet. In this case, we don't have shoes here, they're not a proper wheelchair. But we should um, dress him with his shoes and should put his, his feet in the support. Okay. okay, now I'm going to show how to do the same procedure but with two assistants, how to transfer the patient from the bed to a wheelchair with two assistants now. So first, um, let's continue from uh, this part, the, the patient is already seated, I already put uh, the, the, the belt, the transferring belt in him, now I'm going to use the help of another assistant to do this. So, what do you need to do? Uh, one assistant 
uh, should pull the right knee on the left knee, right knee on the right knee of the patient to secure him, to keep him steady. And then the other nurse should do the same thing with the other one. Now you could ask him to put, again, to put the, uh, the arms on the two assistant and then both of us now secure the seat belt. And then you can ask the patient to lean forward to be easier to make him st uh, stand up and make sure the assistant like, uh, what's the name of it? No, 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 the, 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 the knees, bend the knees to support and then you cannot forget uh, to keep your back steady so you cannot have straight so, so you cannot have a bad posh, 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 posture sure. and then uh, make it hurt when you get older so in the count of three uh, both assistants um, pick, um, stand him up so one two three and then you turn him with your arms and then lean forward and sit. And now the patient is seated, very well seated. And then again, I need to uh, put a shoe in him, in his, in his feet. In this case, we don't have shoes here, they're not a proper wheelchair, but we should um, dress him with his shoes and should put his his feet in the support. Okay. After that, you can move him. <laughs> so, Mr. Duplessis, how was it? Everything is good. Let's go to the examination room. <laughs>